our first snow vlog. It's a little slushy. It's mostly sleet at this point. It's kind of like freezing rain, but it's above freezing outside. So there's a little bit of snow mixed in, but this that I can see on the ground doesn't even look like snow. It just looks like ice. We're under a winter storm warning. I'm really sad. My mom's gonna be super sad if we actually get snow, if we just get this messy crap. I don't think she'll care. <laughs> I think she'll be glad she missed it, but we'll see. They say it's gonna snow all day long, but it's it's not gonna be below, ooh, we're overexposed. It's not gonna be below freezing, so I don't I don't really know. Hi, we live on the top of a mountain. <laughs> I left my scoop outside yesterday. I don't know where my dog is. Hmm. Doggo. Oh, yeah. Hello. Mama just didn't see you. She didn't see you. I think we'll go ahead and pull the feeder in here. I know, it's snowing. Should be fun. The kittens have never seen snow before. And I don't know that we've had snow, like real snow since we've had goats. Our weatherman was talking about this. This will be the first snow that we've had, like I told you Monday, like six years. Like before we moved up here, they got snow all the time. And the first year we moved up here, so the 2013, 2014 school year, I think I missed 15 days of school because of snow. We haven't had like a good snow in a long time. And like that was one of the things I liked about up here is they tend to not get ice storms, they tend to get just snow. And I'm excited if we get just some snow. The roads are not supposed to be bad today because it's gonna stay above freezing. We'll see. We're gonna go over to the new house today and I'm gonna give you guys an update. We got gravel for the barn. So Jeremy's gotten that all put in so that now our fence guy can really get working on our fence stuff. What am I doing? I forgot. So that's really great. So the barn is done and then our fence guy worked for a day over there. And so I'm anxious, I haven't seen what he's done. I went over there yesterday, no, Friday, but I didn't walk around. So I'll be anxious to kind of show you guys an update over there and snow day. So it should be a fun video. All right, are you guys ready for breakfast? Is it breakfast? Yeah? Okay, let's get breakfast. Are you cold? Binks, you have, somebody pooped on you. Somebody pooped on his back. Or he rolled in some poop. We're getting cleaned up. Just started pouring snow. I don't know if you could tell, but there for a while, and now Daisy figured it out. Uh, Tinkerbell was the only one who knew that there was food on this side of the feeder, so she actually got a ton of breakfast, which is awesome. She and Cece were the only ones getting a text message. My phone is in a weird spot. Oh no, my friend has adopted another frog. So this is a funny story. My friend Terry, uh, who's one of my absolute best friends, she last year in her office had a frog in one of her plants. She doesn't know how it got there. And she adopted it and she named it, I think Ghost was its name, because it was like a white frog. And she retired this year, so she had to set it free, but um, it was hysterical. And apparently now she's adopted another frog. So I'm anxious to hear the story about, this was like a tiny, tiny frog. So I'm, I'm anxious to hear the story about this new frog. But instead of filling up the two wall feeders today, we'll fill this feeder and the feeder up. I was gonna look out here. I don't know if you guys can see the snow, but it's really peppering down. So this feeder's staying dry. So we'll fill this one up too. So we'll save all that waste. Let's get these piggies and goaties fed. Their waffles has not come out of the house. It's nice that it's snowing and it's not like bitter cold. Usually here it's like to get snow, it has to be like really, really cold. And the piggies are getting a layer of snow. Did you come in to have doggy breakfast? Mom, he loves snow, loves snow. And we have not had snow since he was like a puppy. But that year it snowed a whole lot. The first year that we had him six years ago, he absolutely loved it. Hopefully we'll get a nice layer he can roll around in. Okay, buddy, we gotta go feed these piggles. Waffles! Come on, buddy!
Well, I don't know how well you guys can see it, but it's definitely snowing really hard, but it's mixed. It's kind of like snow and sleet. It doesn't feel like rain. You can kind of see the ice on the piggies. Waffles was not about coming out of the house to eat. I need to go in here and I bet they need hay. I had it like filled up to the top for them. Be nice. It was below freezing and all this mud was frozen. Yeah, we'll put another flake in there. When we fill the girls up, do you like to stay in the barn today? Yeah, because the snow. I think if it was just snow, they'd be out in it. It's just once the ground gets wet, they don't really, they don't like to feel wet and they don't like the ground to be wet. Cows don't care. But Chief thinks he's a goat, so he's hiding out in the house. Chiefers, do you think you're a goat? The am goat mom, just a really big one. Ooh, no little no. mouth. Good morning, good morning my snow boy. How are ya? Here we go. Normally I'm not, I love snow. I love like light, fluffy, pretty snow, but I'm not usually a big fan of snow days because for me, I really, by May, am ready to be out. Hope it's cool. But now that we're all approved for this AMI, we just sit, shift to virtual for a day and we don't have to make these days up, which I really like. Typically on a day like this, I might keep them locked up. I don't think so today. I think we'll let everybody out. Everybody be free. So hopefully these new feeders are gonna make it where we don't have such a mess. That's exactly what we wanted. The baby goat in the feeder. Where's Max? Max likes to be in that feeder. I think they like being in those feeders when they're empty because they can sleep in there and the big goats don't bother them. It's like being able, they're too big now to get up under this, which is also a favorite spot. And I love like they're all standing in this like square of space. I guess there's like a whole barn. You guys come out here, look. Yeah, it's dry out here. Look at this hay. Yeah, look at this hay. This is for good goats. And see, with the snow, this area will stay really dry. And this will be a great spot just to have them out here. They're two separate feeders. I bet this crew stays out here most of the day and eats. It's what we want. Hello, cheese poofer. We may have some kitties sleeping in the big hay feeders. Yes, we might. I'm good with it, just don't use it as litter box, okay? Now we gotta get in here and rake. filling this feeder and the wood feeder. These two will stay with some hay because we'll have girls locked up at night, but we won't fill it up except for in the evenings when we lock them up. We'll let them clean it up during the day. From what I can tell, they're preferring these feeders because they're so much easier to eat from because they're at head height where these are all a little bit higher. He's up in the rafters. A great mix of goats in here. And my other friends are out here. I just filled this one up. They're doing all right. Patty's in there. I don't know why. But these two feeders and these several are doing really well. So I'm, I'm liking this. I think this is gonna work. It's now raining and not snowing again. I'm going to take the boys some hay and I've gotta medicate the little boys. I think we're good to go for now. We'll hopefully see you guys for an update at the new house. Well, 
I guess we got some snow. I can't wait to go back over to the house and see the girls, but I wanted to give you guys a quick up. I highly doubt there are any goats out in the snow because it is very slushy and wet. It's beautiful here. I can't wait to be over here, guys. Can you imagine the goats and the piggies out in this beautiful snow? It's just gorgeous. We were originally thinking about moving this weekend before the fence catastrophe. So um, I'm glad we weren't doing that. <laughs> so Larry has our fence guy put in some of the corner posts, but that looks like about all he got done. He dug some holes. I mean, this took a lot of work. Don't get me wrong. He was out here for a whole day working. Obviously not here today in the snow. It's so pretty guys and it's so quiet and it's like this nice really fluffy snow. It's wet because it's like right at freezing but they've already called off school for tomorrow. Well we're pivoting to virtual learning whatever that means. So we won't have to make this school day up but we're not physically going to school tomorrow. And I wanted to show you the inside of the barn. Now that it has gravel so you fill it up to the skid still storing some things out here. As you can see, we can't wait. We're talking about getting our kennel stuff um, for stalls. We're gonna do dog kennel, those portable dog kennel panels. The breeder that we bought Zelda and Cece from use those and they work so well for baby goats. What we're kind of thinking, hello focus camera, is putting this, Jeremy wants to try the stalls here. So run the kennel space here and have two stalls and then possibly have one stall here in the corner but this being the main area. I thought to put the, the stalls here. So we may end up with more like three or four stalls than just one but we'll see. It doesn't cost a whole lot more to add some more stalls but that's your update. I'm not gonna walk around right now in the snow but it's very pretty out here. pretty over here. No one is out. I would love to say that you're going to see pretty cute little goats in the snow, uh, but you may have to settle, settle for cute polar bears. What do you think, polar bear? These kittens don't know what snow is. They've never seen it. This polar bear has seen snow. It has been quite a long time. Is it snow? Is it just for you? Is it just for polar bears? Makes them look so yellow. You look so yellow. Let's check on everybody. Hi! You guys haven't eaten all your hay. Have not been out in the snow? We need we need goats in the snow. She just left their feeders out. Nobody knows what to do. Hi! They can get on it. Max and um, Binks decided no. Uh, we did get the piggies out, so we'll go get some food for the piggies. Probably won't do a pumpkin today. He was just laying down, in case you wanted to know. All right, hello. Oh, no pigs in the shop. No pigs in the shop.
What the heck, Mom? Thanks. Calm down, buddy. Calm down. Okay, well that is baby goat's first snow. Maybe tomorrow they'll get out and play in it. It's gonna be really um, cold tonight, so I don't really know. Everybody else is in here. There's hay in all the feeders. There's water in all the bowls. I'll be back to put him to bed. It's so bright out here because of the snow. Jeremy and I were just talking, I bet we got two or three inches more here than we did at our new house. And our new house is not that far away. I bet we got five or six inches of snow here. And we may have gotten two over there, two or three. This is definitely a really big snowstorm and it's all slush. The roads are totally fine and they're gonna be rough in the morning, but. Everybody's taken care of, ready for bed. All right, girlies, we'll see you in the morning. Night-nights. Night-night, CC goat. Night-night, guys. <laughs>